What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. And as you already know, in today's video, we're talking about random access memory, AKA RAM. So I'm gonna be upgrading my computer. Right now I have two eight gigabyte sticks of RAM. I have the G-Scale rib jaw, 3200 megahertz speed. Right here, I got two 16 gigabyte sticks. 3200 megabyte speed, same speed. That way I'm not limiting myself. Uh, the only difference is the capacity, same manufacturer, everything. So these guys should work with what I already have with no issues. So let's get this guy on the bench and let's stick these in and let's start everything up. Here we have our two memory sticks that we're gonna be installing. Here's the computer. And as you can see right here is where my RAM cards are sitting. And I still have two slots available. I only have four slots on the motherboard. So this is where I'll be placing my two new RAM cards. I got the computer on the bench. As you can see, these slots have these little clips right here. You wanna make sure they are both open before you start putting in the RAM memory. Next, you wanna line up this little groove right here with the groove on the motherboard and then just gently give it a little push down until you hear a click. And that's it. Once the flap clicks in, it's gonna securely tighten on the card and now we can move on to the next one. All right, guys, and that's it. It is as simple as that. If I can do it, you can do it. So get it done. Okay, guys, so I got, I got you all in my head. All right, guys, so here's what we got. The RAM's in. I hooked everything up in the back. All we got to do is flip the switch in the back for the power supply. Click on the power button and hopefully, fingers crossed, everything goes smoothly. So let's go. Three, two, one. All right, we got lights. Do we have a boot screen? My boot screen usually comes up here since this is my screen number one. So let's see what we have. Okay, we see the Asus. This is good news, this is good news. All right, so we got There we go. That seems to be working fine. Now let's see if we actually got all of our memory here. So here we are in task manager, memory. And we got all 48 gigs. So there we go, guys. It's that easy. Just put them in, make sure that they are the same latency and make sure that they are the same manufacturer and speed. The capacity doesn't matter and you shouldn't have any other problems. So thanks for watching. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one.